food is my favorite part of harm reduction because it really like it's one thing to like tell somebody you care about them but I think food going back to like just an integral human thing is a way that we show that we care. Food businesses uh, have been huge supporters of social service agencies for eons and when the COVID-19 pandemic hit a lot of those businesses immediately saw a drop in their customer base. I think the Cooking for a Cause program cannot come at a better moment. It's not only allow our businesses to have the uh, capacity to increase their sales and help them survive the pandemic, but it also brightened their spirit during this difficult time. It encouraged us to like just um, do our best to like just make a contribution to this uh, community. And also it gave us um, an income, it's very helpful. They make meals, you know, beautiful meals, like fresh, culturally appropriate, nourishing meals. And then those meals then get distributed out to, we're up to 27 different social service agencies. And the way that we've been doing that is we've been helping them fundraise or providing uh, financial support through grants. Just a warm meal on a cold day like today is just amazing. Like, I don't think anybody should be denied food. And uh, this is why I came back here after my journey downtown and the other side around. I came back home where it's familiar and where I feel safe. I think it's a way to also make our clients and our community feel cared for by people beyond just us. Um, so knowing that there are people that like, they, they don't even know really that are doing this like regularly. It helps people feel like the whole city cares about them, which they should. <laughs>